What's up guys, Jay is here from Tech Simplified. In this video, I'll show you guys 10 useful websites for students. Before we go through the list, let me make it clear. Some of the websites in this list will help you with your studies, some with completing assignments and that kind of stuff, and some with general productivity. With that being said, here's the list of top 10 most useful websites for students. Website number one is edX.org. edX is one of the world's leading massive open online courses platform which offers courses from top universities for free to anyone wishing to learn. You can access any course for free and if you want to get a certification at the end of the course then it will cost you some money. Other major MOOC platforms worth checking out are Udemy, Coursera and Lynda.com. Website number second is Instructables.com. Instructables offers simple how-to guides on almost every topic. If you like making things on your own and fixing things yourself, then you should definitely check it out. Some cool projects to name are making a snake game on a breadboard and building a DIY outdoor seating. Website number three is Keep Me Out. If you struggle to stay away from social media when you are meant to be studying, then use Keep Me Out to block certain distracting websites. Just type in the website which you want to block and set in a time limit and it will block that site for you for that time limit. Website number four is Mint. Mint will help you effortlessly manage your finances in one place. It's free and easy to get started and in just minutes, you'll see where the money is going and get ideas on how to stretch it farther. Best part, it has mobile applications for both Android and iOS as well. Website number five is Cheetography. Cheetography is a collection of over 3,800 cheat sheets and quick references in over 25 languages for everything from Google to travel. Learning Python programming and want a cheat sheet with all the commands in one place? Then just search for it and it will give you different cheat sheets which are free to download in PDF format. Website number 6 is Gutenberg.org. Project Gutenberg provides free online access to text whose copyright has expired. You can find books on a vast variety of topics for free. So far, it has digitalized more than 56,000 texts. Website number 7 is Google Scholars. Google Scholars allow you to search for digital or physical copies of articles. It indexes full-text journal articles, technical reports, preprints, theses, books, and other documents. Hence, if you're looking to do good quality research for your upcoming project, then make sure to use Google Scholars for that. Website number eight is Wolfram Alpha. Wolfram Alpha will help you to get answers to almost every maths and physics question out there. Wondered how the graph of x cubed plus 6x squared plus 4x plus 12 looks? Well, Wolfram Alpha has the answer for that. Apart from maths and physics, there are many more topics to search for. So check them out too. Website number nine is Grammarly. Now Grammarly is not a website, but it's a free Chrome extension that corrects your spelling and grammar mistakes. If you post content on the internet quite often, then you should definitely use it. They have a free version that does basic spell checking and grammar check and paid version for more advanced features. I'm not giving the last website. I want each one of you guys to mention down your favorite websites in the comment section. This way, we will get a whole lot of websites which will be useful to many people. If you're a student, then feel free to check out my tutorial videos on Microsoft Word, Excel and PowerPoint. They will definitely help you in your job life. So that's it for today, guys. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, then please consider subscribing and do check out my other videos. Thank you for...